The next split term is abstract, which is the opposite of concrete, and it describes ideas, concepts, and qualities. The more intangible, general, and associated with intellect, the more abstract the concept is likely to be. The example I chose is from pages 51 and 52, and it says, I never dreamed that Rhodesia or any place in Africa would be so peaceful, lovely, and clean, chimed in the wisp in a misguided attempt, no doubt, to make amends for her earlier faux pas of African courtesy. I could not bear it. It was like a personal insult. So um, this is the instance where Byron has brought his wife um, home to... Um, to Zimbabwe to, you know, kind of reconcile with his mother, um, which that's another story. But anyway, this woman is British. She's coming to this area um, and she's kind of making some missteps, I guess, and she doesn't realize she's doing it. Um, but she's exhibiting uh, some, some pretty clear examples of prejudice and ignorance and um, just kind of a lack of awareness. So anyway, this, this example really goes with the idea of abstract because those ideas of ignorance and prejudice um, and some of the other pieces that Maria examines in this book, like racism, inequality, um, nationalism, progression, these are all abstract ideas, um, intangible, you know, kinds of things. And what's what's interesting and important to note about these ideas is that because they are abstract, it makes them really difficult to pin down and like do something about because their mindsets, their ways of thinking that um, you know, you can't just go out and and clean up a street or um, build a, a temporary housing unit. Um, to fix these kinds of things. It's much more ingrained in culture and um, ways of thinking and belief systems and values and, and all kinds of things. So those abstract ideas like prejudice, like is exhibited in this excerpt, um, like I said, it's just one of the many abstract concepts that Marer explores in this book. And I urge you to think about why the abstract nature of ideas like like prejudice and the ones that I mentioned before, why does their abstract nature make them so difficult to combat and to solve and to do something about?